We turn to the continuing fight against COVID-19, and there are three things we are tracking right now. Cases continue to rise in our area. In Virginia, more than 1,500 people are in the hospital with coronavirus. That is a 90% increase in just two weeks. And as the numbers spike, parents are pushing back against in-person learning. We're going to look at the protest plan to make virtual learning an option in just a few minutes. But first, a new rule for Fairfax County Public Schools. Student athletes are now required to be vaccinated before they hit the field. Darren Haynes is with us now to talk through this new development. Dee? Yeah, less like you said students at Fairfax County Public Schools who want to play winter in spring sports will be required to show proof of a COVID-19 vaccination. This decision marks one of the first such student vaccine mandates na nationwide. The new vaccine requirement will take effect November 8th. School officials say they'll work with the Fairfax County Health Department to make sure any student who needs to get vaccinated vaccinated can do so. According to the latest vaccine uh, vaccine data, a total of 75% of Fairfax County 16 to 18 year olds are currently fully vaccinated. So here's my take on all of this. We all know one way to stop the spread of COVID-19 is to practice social distancing, but I'm sorry, y'all. You can't play sports staying six feet apart. You're going to come in contact with another person and that increases your chances of getting COVID-19, which then could affect you, your teammates, friends and family members. That's a team I hope you're not trying to let down. Listen, I'm a former athlete, played sports from Little League at age six all the way up to my senior year of college. This is a form I had to submit in order to play high school sports. There you can see I had to get a few vaccines like the polio vaccine. If I didn't get it, I couldn't play. There are two things about people we don't like change and we don't like the way things are. Fortunately, just like I had to do back in the day, in order to play the sport we love, we're going to have to accept change and that's getting the vaccine. Yeah, D, you've said this is a lot like wearing a helmet when you, you play the game. You got to wear the helmet to protect you to keep yeah. you safe. So the vaccine will keep you safe. It's that simple. Now we'll see if other school districts are going to do the very same thing, D. Thank you. you know,